Welcome back to Newswatch 10. I'm Jeremy Babin. There's a lot to be said for 50 years of consecutive winning seasons at Dalton. Lots of hard work and dedication from players and coaches. Someone in particular who's made an impact in all areas is Catamount's offensive line coach, Bill Mayo. Not many people have Dalton football credentials like Bill Mayo. After nine years on the middle school staff, the former offensive tackles in his second season coaching the offensive line at Dalton High, teaching young men what Dalton taught him nearly three decades ago. Just the winning attitude that, that Dalton instills in, in their players, that, the that you get through the coaches and you get through the fans and, and the community, um, really helps you in your development, whether you go on and play in college or just later on in life. Coach Mayo, he's, a, he's an asset to our program and uh, really just relates to our players very well and has a great demeanor with them and is a, does a tremendous job of teaching fundamentals. And his personality really fits in well with our staff. Bill was an outstanding football player but he was also an outstanding person. A good student and he uh, got a scholarship to Tennessee. He started four years. He started as a legitimate freshman and then made All-American and he represented Dalton uh, exceptionally well and he's just a fine human being. But the two-time SEC player's career didn't end in college. Mayo signed a pro contract with the Green Bay Packers. Then, on the verge of another chapter in Mayo's football career, Coach suffered a knee injury while working out in Knoxville, leading to one of seven operations, ending a career before it began. What if, what if you know, the injuries can happen? No, I don't think so. You know, I, I, um, I was very fortunate to, to get to do a lot of things and go a lot of places and, and uh, have a lot of fun experiences through football. And, and I don't think looking back at the past and saying what if does you any good at all, you know, always looking forward and, and moving forward. And that's the kind of way I've tried to, whether it's athletic life or, or, or whatever, uh, you know, fun, uh, facet of my life, just, just kind of look ahead and, and move forward. With Coach's playing career behind him, Mayo's focus is now teaching others and something he enjoys very much. It's very rewarding to get out and work with these kids. Uh, I help Coach, uh, Coach Chad Jordan and I coach the offensive line. It's a lot of fun being around those kids and, and working with them and they, do, and they have a terrific attitude and, and do a great job for us. Dalton takes the field on the road Friday night against Northwest in Tunnel Hill.